Hello everyone, my name is Alana B. Welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And give this video a like up American Pickers alum Frank Fritz has made an unexpected appearance in a video shared by the show years after his firing. Viewers have been pleading with History Channel to bring Frank back for two years. The American Pickers Facebook account shared footage from an old episode featuring Frank, 57, and current star Mike Wolf looking at cars together. Frank was fired by the network nearly two years ago and has been battling major health issues. He last appeared on American Pickers during a March 2020 episode, taking time off to recover from back surgery shortly after which left him with 185 stitches and two rods in his spine. During his time off the show, Frank lost 65 pounds. He also told the U.S. Sun that he entered rehab to be treated for alcohol addiction for 77 days. Frank revealed his feud with co-star Mike during his 2021 interview with the U.S. Sun. Frank said at the time, I haven't talked to Mike in two years. He knew my back was messed up but he didn't call me up and ask how I was doing. That's just how it is. The show is tilted towards him 1,000%. I can't even bend that far down to show you how much. That's fine. It's like you've got Aerosmith and there's Steven Tyler and he's the front man. I found my spot. I'm second and he's number one on the show. That's no problem with me. Maybe he does have a problem. He even confessed. I think Mike wants to get his brother Robbie in there to replace me. I don't know why he's behaving like that towards me. Fans often seek updates from Mike, 58, and have been begging him and History Channel to bring Frank back to the show. In the video, Frank and Mike were seen digging around a massive property filled up with cars, motorcycles, parts, and more. During the pick, they uncovered an ace four-cylinder motorcycle and Mike was immediately taken with it. Mike shared a brief history of the bike in a confessional interview before making an offer on that bike and others he was interested in. Amid the dealings, Mike decided to confer with Frank about numbers. In the end, they offered up more than $80,000 for various pieces on the property. Mike's looking for my blessings on this pick, but I'm more than a little nervous when we're talking about this kind of money. You know, I mean, we're talking $85.90,000, Frank said in a confessional of his own. Frank hasn't been heard from much since leaving American Pickers. The TV personality has suffered some serious medical setbacks in recent years. Earlier this month, 911 audio was released revealing that he was rushed to the hospital four times after suffering seizures and pneumonia. In July, he was hospitalized for a stroke and sent to a nursing facility to recover before returning to his home in Yoa. The U.S. Sun exclusively obtained four 911 calls placed from Frank's house that resulted in Frank being rushed to the hospital. On November 17, Frank's caregiver called 911 because he was having a seizure. She told the operator, he just came home from inpatient rehab for a stroke. He just had a full-blown seizure, maybe more than one, he's been shaking. She then asked the operator if there is anything she can do to help him, as she was transferred to medical. On December 7, another caregiver called 911 for elevated blood pressure. She said on the call, I have a 59-year-old stroke victim with elevated blood pressure. You could hear Frank moan in the background, as she could be heard telling him, you have to go because your blood pressure is too high. He responded, Oh, December 21 for possible pneumonia. Frank's guardian then called the next day. He said in the call, I'm going to need an ambulance to take someone to the hospital because I think they have pneumonia. I'm the guardian. He's handicapped. He's wheelchair bound. Following his medical challenges, Frank's friends filed an emergency appointment of a temporary guardian and conservator for the star claiming his decision-making capacity is so impaired after the July stroke at his home. The documents obtained by the U.S. Sun read, because of his stroke, 
Mr. Fritz's decision-making capacity is so impaired that he is unable to care for his own safety or to provide for necessities such as food, shelter, clothing, or medical care, without which physical injury or illness may occur. Mr. Fritz's decision-making capacity is so impaired that he is unable to make, communicate, or carry out important decisions concerning his own financial affairs. An exhibit was mentioned in the court papers from a doctor, confirming Frank does not have decisional capacity. The legal papers continued. Decisions must be made for Mr. Fritz's care and placement while he continues to recover and receive treatment for his injuries. Appointment of a guardian and conservator is necessary to avoid immediate harm to him. The petitioner requested a separate longtime friend of Frank's, who has been assisting him in decision-making since the stroke, be his guardian. Midwestone Bank is the conservator handling Frank's financial affairs. The guardian will help Frank with his Crohn's disease treatment and continued physical therapy. He will also help the former American Pickers star grocery shop, cook, and get Frank to any activity he feels up to. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel, American Pickers, and stay with us.